Hey everybody, welcome back. I have a flip through today for this um, adult coloring book for you by Black River Art and it is called the Living at Dead Girls Coloring Book. I saw this book, um, well I saw some images colored from it in one of the coloring groups I'm in. I'm pretty sure it was the Reading with Pugs group, but I'm not positive. Um, and I was like, I asked the person what book that was from and they uh, told me and I went and right away and found it on Amazon because I knew that it was a book I was going to love. So it is a Grayscale book and I don't usually purchase Grayscale. I have a couple, but um, I really, really liked the images so much that I decided to get this. Um, it is a matte cover and um, you get a lot of images in this book and it was not expensive. I want to say it was $4.99. So um, you can see it's a nice thick book. The back cover looks the same. Um, and I will do a flip for you. Um, so it's Black River Art Presents Living Dead Girls. And uh, the copyright was 2017 by Carlin Douglas on this. I don't think I have any books from Black River Art, so this might be my very first one. Um, book belongs to Paige with no image to color on that, obviously. And then, like I said, these are Grace Scott images. They are, like, they have a little frame around them, so that's nice. I just thought they were really fun and like pretty, you know, like feminine, even though they're skulls. And I don't, like I said, I have a lot of grayscale, but I thought I'd give them a try, you know. I'll probably use alcohol markers in these. I think that one's fun. The paper is Amazon paper, um, your typical Create Space slash Amazon paper, so just so you know. I like that one. And that one. I pretty much like them all, to be honest with you. I just think they're really neat. One's really pretty. That one's a little bit on the creepy side. <laughs> Cute. That one's really nice with the hair. I could do without the snakes, but the hair is pretty. That one's pretty with a Mardi Gras mask on it. That's unusual. Lots of images in this one. I didn't count them, but there's a lot. I like that one a lot too. I think that one's really pretty. That one's got a big mouth. <laughs> And I think that's the end. And then it lists some other um, titles available. 
Um, so I will say this, if you already have this book or you purchase it based on my flip through, you may notice that there is an extra illustration in your copy. And that is because I did remove one of the images from the book. When I first got it in the mail and I opened it and I was looking through it, there was an image of a woman, skeleton woman, cradling a skeleton baby. I found it disturbing and so I asked Keith if he would remove it for me. I didn't even want to look at it long enough to cut it out. That's unusual. That's never happened to me before. I've never wanted to page torn out of any of my coloring books ever and I have a lot of coloring books. Um, but yeah, so he saw it and he said he understood and absolutely he took it out and threw it away for me. So you will see that there is an extra image in your book. Um, but that's why I had mine taken out. But other than that, I love this book. I think it's super fun. Um, right up my alley and I'm really excited to dive into it with alcohol markers. And like I said, my experience with Grayscale is not very big, but um, I just thought it looked like fun and simple and it was a very inexpensive book. So yeah, I'm gonna dive right in. I'm really excited. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I will leave a link where you can purchase this book on Amazon in the description section below. And I am an Amazon affiliate. So if you do purchase it via the link provided, I will receive a small profit. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in the next one.